stealing, you said. <laughs> See what it's like living an honest life, you said. So it's my fault we're in this mess? <laughs> it's always your fault. <laughs> That's the last of them. Okay. It's always my fault. I hope you will forgive the circumstances that brought you here. My name is Nazi, and I need your help. You've got a funny way of asking. Actually, I was talking to her. Okay, you're the man who has everything. What do you need us for? I also have many enemies. And they have threatened the life of my daughter, Amira. Still not seeing what this has to do with me. The Brotherhood of the Falling Sword has been hired for the task. The Brotherhood? You've heard of them. Then you know they are patient and deadly. Rather than wait, I plan to draw their assassin out. Amira's birthday party is two days from now. That is when he will strike. You look quite like her, Anissa. And I need bait. Wait a minute. You want me to pose as some spoiled little witch girl so some psycho can take a shot at me? No, thank you. We're leaving. Of course. I wonder if my good friend, the Magistrate, knows how you make a living, Anissa. Do they still cut off hands for stealing, I wonder? This is blackmail. It's not blackmail. It's extortion. Blackmail usually involves money. I need to be paid. A lot. I figure we need to focus on the north and south entrances. That's where we're most vulnerable. What's the matter with you two? We're supposed to be partners, Sal. You don't just take a job without asking us first. There wasn't time. Look, Anissa needs our help. Say what you want about her, but she's had our back every time we've needed her. Except for the time she's lied to us and almost gotten us killed. Right, except for that. Come on, it's one assassin. We can take him. We seal this place up. No one in, no one out. Except for the hundreds of dinner guests showing up in two nights. Right, except for them. This girl better be worth the hassle. I hate you. You ruined my life. You know the situation, Amira. I don't care. It's my party, and I'm not even allowed to be there. Huh? You expect people to believe this piece of street trash is me? Oh, don't worry. With the right face paints, I can make myself look much uglier. Why, you impertinent little... We will <sighs> talk about this later. Let go of me! Ugh. Lovely girl. This spot is perfect. I can hit any target within the mansion grounds. What's going on down there? Renovations. Apparently, the giant mansion needs to be bigger. Duncan always says, rich people have the strangest hobbies. Where is Duncan? Getting to know the guards. I want you focused. I want you frosty. This isn't some limp-wristed stab artist you'll be facing. This is the Brotherhood! One wrong move, and we're all dead. Ah, What's going on here? He's trying to tear my face off! Why, I never! I was plucking the lady's eyebrows. Mistress Amira insists on sculpted eyebrows 
for every formal occasion. One step closer and I'll sculpt your eyes out of your skull. Okay, okay, let's hold off on the uh, eye gouging for a moment. Perhaps we could take a short break? Hmm. I look like a circus act. You see this? It's made from the intestines of a goat. Didn't really need to know that. He wanted to put it on my face! If you're scared, look, we're not going to let that assassin anywhere near you. It's not that. I just... <sighs> the closest I come to the rich is when I'm picking their pockets. I'm gonna look like a fool. Listen to me. I've seen you face down lunatics, slave traders, and a frank army. This is nothing. And you should think about how much you're getting paid. I guess you better send the eyebrow plucker back in. <clears throat> Knife. We go. Invitations, invitations, please. A Frank guard. Oh, how delightfully decadent. Come away, dear. You don't know where he's been. All the nastiest. Place. Could you try and behave? I can try. Hey. Announcing. The arrival of our guest of honor on this, the day of her birth, the jewel of the house of Naze, Amira.
Just a gift! Sorry about that. Let's get you cleaned up. No invitation. Oh, the bear was the rabbit. <laughs> yes, most amusing. <laughs> Get me out of here before I start stabbing the guests. Why do you think I took all your knives? Salahuddin! Salahuddin! My people have brought word. The assassin has been spotted. Where? A house. On Basket Street. That's clear across town. But if we catch him there before he gets here, then... You're leaving? What about me? Tarek's here, and I brought in some backup. I feel all warm and safe now. If you want me to stay, I'll stay. It's your call. occasion. My friends, I bid you all a good night. Don't even think about it. Please, I don't care how much it's worth. Tacky is still tacky. If you're finished, why don't you take off my clothes and get back under whatever rock you crawled out from? Listen, girl. For the past few days, you've been surrounded by people whose one job has been to risk their lives for yours. Some gratitude might be in order. I missed my party because of you people! Uh, get your hands off me! Get inside and keep your mouth shut. You must be looking for Nazi's daughter. Less pretty, more annoying. I think she went that way. You'll pay for that. Amira, Amira, what happened to Anissa? Huh? 
And who are you? My name is Zara. My father's name is General Beram. And you're going to tell me where he is. Sal! Wait! We need a plan here. We don't even know what's going on. The Brotherhood has Anissa. Either she's alive and a captive, or... Either way, I'm finding who took her. And how do you plan to do that? I'm going to beat up a lot of people, see what they know. If that doesn't work, I'm going to beat up even more people. And what about Amira? There's still a price on her head. I don't care! Fine. You two keep an eye on Amira. I'll see what's going on out there. My people are in your hands now. Keep them safe. You're lying! Above all things, my father was a survivor. So why don't you tell me what really happened? I can't say it any plainer than that. Ask your people. What people? The marauders are no more. Scattered to the four winds. You are my witness. Tell me where he is, or I'll bring my man in here. He won't ask us gently. You know, I'm not telling you anything anymore, because you need to learn to ask nicely, you thick little twit. Wait. You need to know, thick can mean either stupid or fat. Greetings, criminals of Byblos. A friend of mine is in trouble. You're going to tell me everything you know. I swear, we don't know anything about the Brotherhood. So, no one knew anything? Nothing. I don't know what else to do. It's not your fault. Nazik can be quite persuasive when he wants something. He managed to talk the debt collectors out of repossessing his home. He's in debt? Up to his eyes! His shipping business went under. He borrowed money, using all of his property as collateral. What property? That mansion, a few rundown houses on Basket Street. Why? Mustafa, you're a genius! I know! Wait, what did I do? <laughs> Got it off the assassin. It's my fault he got away. I had him. If I just held on, we'll get her back. Please, go find Anissa. She saved my life. When we find who took her, at least I'll have somebody to hit. We'll try our best, Amira. Oolong, show them out. Somebody to hit. Stop this at once! What is the meaning of this? Naze, meet our Brotherhood assassin. It's a perfect match. There is no assassin. This has been a setup from the start. Tell me, Naze. How much did they pay you? Stop it! Leave him alone! What's the going rate on betrayal? And why would I do that? I don't know. But the house where the assassin was holed up, you own it. What did you do to Anissa? Nothing. I just took the money. I had to. 
We would have lost everything! <laughs> now what do we do? It didn't have to be like this. Yes, it did. That look on your face? Your monster of a father had it all the time. watching from the balcony all night. No one left the mansion grounds. I just assumed a Brotherhood assassin could slip through. But what if... Nobody left. Which means... Anissa's still here. Face paint. of raising yourself. Gone, Zara. You know this. Why should I believe any of you? Because if Behram was alive, he would have found you by now. Girls are so weird. Anissa? You risked your life for me. Thank you. Here. I, I hope it's not too tacky. Not at all. All this to find a father she ran away from? He wasn't much of a father, but he was the only one she had. I know how she feels. <laughs> 